What is going on guys and welcome back to another Legend player review. We are going to be looking at Rude Hullet today and he looks completely insane just like last year. And is he as good? Let us find out. If you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coins, check out battle.com. The link will be in the description and use the code Itani to get 5% off. If you're looking for PSN cards or Microsoft Point G2, we have, back, have them back in stock today. So make sure you check them out as well. Link in the description. Use the code Itani to get a little discount. Now, Rude Hullet, I am reviewing him before the patch that EA's were going to be releasing sometime soon that will fix the shooting and the dribbling on the pressure. I'm not too sure how they're going to fix it, but that's what they are planning. Now, this review, just for future reference, if anyone's going to come back later on after the patch is out, this is pre-patch video footage. So, inside the penalty area, this guy's got good shooting. I mean, easily you could finish anything with him. And you'll see so many times defenders are all around him. This guy's got the strength trait. And you'll see numerous times defenders, three to four of them, just crowding around him. And he always finds a way to get into the penalty area and score a goal. Now, he does have a couple of things that I really want to highlight in the video. And that is his dribbling and his strength. For some reason, some players, well mostly, you will either have someone that is really good at dribbling or someone that is going to just be able to force his way into the penalty area but has shit dribbling. Now with Rude Hulet, you have both. You have the option to do both. You could easily dribble past anyone or you could just force your way into the penalty area. It is up to you but the option is there and that's something that I really like about him. Um, he has 4 star weak foot and 4 star skills and that's exactly what I mean. If you are a skiller, he's another option. Like that, That's another option to attack with. So Rude Hulet is an amazing player and not only that, you could easily put him in different positions striker center attack and mid central midfielder central defensive mid but central defensive mid i think he's wasted Cent center attack and mid or even a striker is my favorite options for him now he has long shots as a con because as you guys know it's so hard to score long shots in fifa 15 unless you have ronaldo which has which is the only easy player I have found to score long shots. You might score with a couple of other players, but it is very rare to score a long shot. And I found it the same with Rude Hullet. So I'm not going to be lying to you guys saying, oh, he has good long shots, but not show you any long shots in the video. And this is pre patch. So it might get fixed once they patch it up, and he might have amazing long shots afterwards. But for now, from this day, he has bad long shots so finishing dribbling forcing your way into the penalty area four star weak foot four star skills and the heading is something on another level you'll see him head it so many times in the penalty area i just didn't want to put too many headers in because it would just waste the video i actually scored so many goals with this guy i couldn't even fit it in one video i played so many games and i scored so many goals i just couldn't put it in one video because of how awesome he is he's also got a very very good pace so if you want a pace abuse of him Easily you can do it with Hullet because he only has 86 pace, but he feels a lot faster than that. And even if defenders catch up to him with that strength trait and his strength and aggression, it really helps him just push through onto goal. So overall, he's an amazing player. Definitely recommended by me. And if you combine it with George Weir right next to him, holy shit, you have a deadly attack force. But Rude Hullet is um, one of my favorites as well. I think a lot of players that have a lot of pace and a lot of strength are going to be one of the best players to use in FIFA 15 Ultimate Team pre-patch. Let's see what happens once EA patch the game and see what changes. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I'd really appreciate a like. Make sure you let me know in the comments who you would you like me to review next. Would you like to see a Pele review? Let me know in the comment section below. Rude Hullet gets a 9.8 out of 10.